today I'm going to be talking about the time I had a cat basically give birth on my lap. <laughs> so, this is going to be the first, one of the first videos that I actually do this talking thing with the camera up in my face, I guess. <laughs> I, I don't know. But yeah, that's, that's, that's happening, I guess. <laughs> um, so, yes, let's get on to the story. So, like, two years ago, I used to set up traps in our backyard. My phone is going off again. I just tried to retake, I just tried to take this video and my phone went off. But, um, <laughs> random. So, like, two years ago, I used to keep, er, well, I used to keep rabbit traps in our backyard, like I said, because we had rabbits eating up our garden. And, um, one of the day, I came home from school and there was a cat. Well, the trap was like a small, it's a live trap. It's not like it's gonna kill him or anything or even hurt him, but it was a smaller trap and I saw it was closed and I walked up to it and there's a cat. <laughs> so of course I'm gonna get the cat out right away <laughs> because it was a smaller cage. It was one of the small, it was probably the smaller of the bigger live, like live traps that we have. I, have it any sense <laughs> like because they have ones for like squirrels and then they have ones for rabbits and then they have the really big ones that are for like raccoons and stuff and the smallest we have is for like rabbits but then we have like two for like chipmunks and squirrels I guess but um yeah so it was in a rabbit one and I don't know why she went in there I just had some guinea pig grain because obviously I'm a guinea pig and um and I had him like around this time so I threw some guinea pig grain in there and I didn't know if it was going to catch the rabbit or anything. I think I threw some hay in there. So I have no idea why this cat walked in there. I don't know. I guess, I th honestly, I think it was just meant to happen. Like, for its own good. Like, I'm not a religious person, but I feel like something, like, I feel like the cat knew. <laughs> like, this sounds weird. But, um, so I checked the trap and I found the cat. And I picked up the trap and I walked over into the other part of the lawn so I wasn't like right in the middle of our garden because I one I didn't want to be bit up by bugs and two it's just like obviously I'm not gonna like just want the cat to run away <laughs> and um because normally if I I've trapped cats before that are wild and we've just brought them to paws and claws and stuff and this isn't the first time that I've trapped a pregnant cat or not trapped a pregnant cat but like gotten a pregnant cat I guess but that's a story for another time but, um, so, I got this cat, and 